Hello there, bitizens, and welcome to another episode of Heroes of the Storm. My name is Francesca, and this week we are playing Chen, who saw some changes during the Lieutenant Morales patch, or Morales, or Morales, or whatever the hell her name is, but he saw some changes, he got buffed. And you'll see I'm using the Treasure Goblin mount, which is a 20,000 gold mount that is actually being removed from the store on the 27th, I want to say, of the month. Uh, the 27th of October, so that's why I saved up for this. Uh, I don't currently have Morales, and Artanis, who you'll see in this game, is currently on pre-release, which means people who bought the Legacy of the Void StarCraft pack or something get access to him early, which is, you know, just a, a chopping incentive. Anyway, we're going to be doing a kind of tanky, a tanky build, basically. So we're going to grab Regen Master here, which allows us to gather orbs and gain, you know, health regen. Because um, that will give us a little bit of sustain on top of the fact that we can just chug brew. Because I'm a mana-less character. So instead of instead of drinking mana, using mana, I use brew. Uh, so basically if I use an ability here like this, uh, you'll see there, those are my abilities. And if I press D, I chug, I gain a shield, and I gain mana. Now my abilities are a flying kick that currently just deals damage, a keg throw which slows. And if you hit someone with the keg throw and then use your breath of fire on them, it does extra damage because they're covered in alcohol, which you then ignite, basically, is, is, is the idea behind that kind of ability set is that um, is that you you do that basically um, so that those are his basic abilities um, and you can actually it's very easy to clear lane because you can just keep casting abilities you don't have to worry about mana or anything um, you can just kind of spam them out a little bit like so and then chug while you take damage because obviously that gives you the shield which stops the damage kind of hitting you basically whilst your cooldowns go off um, and that's a big part of kind of how you how you play Chen uh, I want to get that orb, but I don't think I can while I'm alone. Uh, no, I'm not going to be able to get it, and I took damage for it. That's a shame. Sometimes you just have to let him go, like, it's, it's not worth it. And the problem is, because I don't have a heal, I, I took too much damage there, because this is uh, 2v1. I'm going to ping for help, basically. Like, Sonya rotated, and they've, they've all gone down bot, um, which is fine if they get a kill, but if they don't, not so good. And I'm really having a trouble in 2v1 lane. I wouldn't I wouldn't normally be too worried in a, in a 1v1 situation, because, you know, you just, you just chug and you kind of are, are irritating more than anything. Uh, but there we go. Anyway, that's that's fine. We got an orb there, which is good. Uh, and Rhaegar seems to have left to help somewhere else because we've got four people in bottom lane. Holy crap. Well, I mean, if it, if it works, it works. Sorry for a little bit of lag there, guys. I'm not sure what's going on. Um, but you have to remember to keep chugging whenever you get a chance to refresh your brew. Refresh your brew. The other thing is, for the duration of brew, my cooldown will reset, so I can effectively be constantly chugging. So now, for example, by the time that's off, I'm now chugging again. So you'll notice that I can't actually take damage in this situation. And this is actually in some ways an interesting way to do the wave, because what it means is that obviously she's attacking me, but nothing is actually happening. I spam out my abilities, and then, you know, continue on our way. We'll do some damage to her while we can. Um, the next talent I'm going to grab is Amplified Healing, because we have Charism to heal me. Uh, and also this increases the regen on my orbs, which is why we picked that talent first, because we're going to amplify our healing. Uh, the increased regen becomes even better, because, you know, it actually amplifies your regen, not just your, not just your healing. Uh, which is pretty good. We'll keep an eye on the middle. Our tennis and thing are, are not really doing much. And this is actually a really tough lane for Valor because you'll notice that she's hitting me, but not nothing is really happening. And that's 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 really hard for her. Like she's she's auto attacking me, but I have my shield, um, so I can just kind of keep hitting her there. And then Sonya came in. I didn't see the rotation because I wasn't paying attention to the map. Um, but we're in a fairly tasty position here in terms of in terms of pushing people out of the lane. And we'll actually go and hand in our gems now while that we can, while we can while we push the lane. I mean, she's going to kill this anyway. But if we can freely hand these in, that's kind of good. Uh, and I guess I'll head down here. I could rotate down to the bottom of the map and try and get you know get some some kind of sick plays off. Oh, beautiful! Right, so we can slow him. So that was a really nice um, wall by uh, by Naz, basically. Um, we're gonna make sure we kill this, uh, kill this minion here to get the orb, and then we'll head top, I think. Chug up first. Oh, oh yeah, so he does this, this, like, laser, like, kind of, like, dash in, dash out ability. Um, you saw there, so just, that's to be aware of. Um, and we'll come in here, and you'll notice we got the orb here as well, so we didn't actually miss any orbs on the top lane, I do believe. Uh, in that rotation, and we got a kill, so we're a little bit ahead in XP, which is good. Um, so yeah, all in all, I would say a very successful play. Uh, I ran out of brew there, so I can't actually set these on fire, which is annoying. But yeah, Vala's just, she can't really do anything because I, I can out, I can shield out her damage. Like for two players, you can't really shield out the damage, but if there's just one, you can. Uh, she's actually going to go and try and hand in, so we'll go and stop her. Oh no, she's not. Uh, I don't have a missing ping, unfortunately. Oh god, it's, why is everyone dying? Holy crap, they are completely out of position. Like they've extended way too far out and they just gave the enemy team four kills. 
Like, they, they chase too hard, I guess, is what happened there. Like, if you see everyone dying at this point in the map, that's them chasing too hard and the enemy team, you know, uh, making them pay the price, basically. The other thing you can do um, as Chen is you can waste ammo. So if, if the towers are shooting you and you're chugging, then they, they waste ammo, basically. Um, so we've got a talent here, so we'll just get out of the way and grab a talent. We'll grab... Uh, let me think. Gains bonus is based on current level of brew. This one. So you get, when you're a high brew, you get movement speed. And when you're at low brew, you get health regen. So you can kind of use your brew to, for different advantages depending on what you want. Um, so if I, if I feel like, oh, I'm kind of low on health. If I just wait for a bit to, before I chug um, and I'm in a safe position, then that's fine. Whereas if I'm full on brew, because I'm liable to be attacking, then what that means is that I can, um, I'll then have an easier time of attacking people, I guess. I don't know really what he's trying to do here. I am Chen, hear me roar. Do pandas roar? I guess not really. I'm actually just, I'm not going to try and chase him there. Because what we need to do is we need to clear the, uh, we need to clear the, what Gemma call it? Nova needs to leave. She should be okay. Yeah, she's fine. I didn't realize that was Nova. Um, else I would have been more careful. We'll just, we'll just chug through this again. Like, you notice I didn't take too much damage there. And now we can back off. And if we, if we then kind of spam out our abilities to low brew, we'll get obviously increased health regen. So now we have increased health regen. Though actually I can just tap well, so I'm just going to chug right back up. Um, this isn't ideal, to be honest, but... The other thing is, you when you when you tap well, uh, as a... When you tap well, um, and you have amplified healing, the well tap actually does a lot more healing as well. As well. <laughs> uh, but it's pretty decent. I need to, I need to go down to, to the middle lane. Like, there seems to be a lot of things going kicking off here, so we'll, we'll head down. Uh, if we can get our slow out on someone, like so, then we can do a lot. Like, it's very hard to run away from Chen. The only problem is, once you run out of brew, you have to rechug, but then you've got your Q to kind of reinitiate, so it's not really too much of a problem. Uh, in, in my personal opinion, anyway. Um, we'll chuck this back up. We've got enough, also, I've got enough um, gems. If I hand mine in, we should be good. But what I want to do here is I, I really want to get that orb first. There we go. Just to make sure I'm 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 maximizing my stacks. Oh, are they, are they fighting? I'll just back off a little, I think. We're all good. We're all good. I'm going to I'm gonna hand in, I think. I think this is a safer plan. They can retreat, so I'll ping for retreat, and I'll turn in my gems, and then we'll get web weavers, and then once we've got web weavers... We can be a little bit more aggressive. I'm also going to make sure I grab these uh, these gems. Or at least some of them. So I'm frontlining here. So I want to basically be in a position where we're in an okay position. Oh crap, they hit 10. Uh, we're going to die. There's nothing we can do here. They they basically hit 10 and I didn't realize I'm engaged to fight, which was dumb. That was a, a dumb way to play. A dumb way to play. But it's not over yet. It's not over yet. And when we hit 10, we'll grab Storm, Earth, and Fire. Wandering Keg uh, got a cooldown reduction. And I believe a mana. It's cheaper, not mana cost. But I think I think they tried to buff it. But uh, basically... Ah, he didn't see they had LCs or ultimates either. Basically, um, I'm going to go top because that's where the fighting is. This is good because if you're on no health, you just split into three forms if you cast it in time. And then you can use it to run away or to aggress. Like, it's a, it's a fairly cheeky talent. And it makes Chen much harder to kill than you would expect. Um, all things considered. We can just hit him a little bit. Uh, I'm just kind of trying to distract him. He's not really going to be coming back into the fight here. Uh, oh, Nova died. I guess Nova got picked off. They have a, I believe, a, like a reveal ability. I just ran past that and got took a lot of damage. Illidan should, should be dead. There we go. Um, and if we, if we, oh, I was going to say if we stop them taking his, his gems, that would be good, but meh, whatever. Didn't, did, didn't quite didn't quite work the way way we wanted it to. Uh, what is Artanis doing? Can we can we kill him? I don't think I'm close enough. Oh, that's painful. Charism shouldn't chase that. We should just take the fort. We should basically we can take the fort, so we should take the fort. Uh, you have locked me in. Whatever shall I do? I know I'll jump on Nova and kill her. <laughs> Not Nova, Vala. Sorry. Both the. Uh... We've slowed him now. And that, that's basically zoned him out, so he can't get out. Oh, he, he got his all off, though. Unfortunate. Uh, chug, 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 chug. And then we'll just... I think I can actually... Oh, I can't hit him. Oh, wow, that was slow. So I tried to use my ult there. Uh, you can actually... So you spread out, and then you, you bring all of the characters in together like that. Um, and you can use it to run away. So if they kill the green one, for example, the, the red one, I'll just, I'll just run away with him. Um, and I should be okay. And then after the time runs out, I just turn back into Chen on full health. So, you know, not really too much problem. Nova is dead. Like, Nova is so, so dead. Oh, no, I've managed to zone them out. I think. I think. I'm going to chug here. Uh, yeah, enemy team is all there. Just just retreat. Like, I tried to save her and she came back in. Like, why would you just waste your waste your life like that? Jesus Christ. Okay, we're good. 
This is the thing about Chen, is you can kind of do these things and you'll be okay. Uh, a little bit of cheeky play. I'm going to make sure I get another orb there. And then kill some of these, get some more uh, gems. Sorry if there's a lot of right-clicking going on. I kind of right-click a lot. Jesus Christ. So there's Illidan. It's Nova ult. Oh, wow. That was really good. I think. We killed Vala. And we should have, yep, this guy. And then uh, we can zone out the rest of the enemy team. Yep, and then we can aggress. So we may as well just aggress here and push this lane. Because we're grouped and it, 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 it would be a sensible thing to do. Um, so I'll just chug well, as I can. Just be a little careful. See, you notice he keeps putting his ring around me, but there's, there's kind of no point to doing that in, in some respects. Because I'm just going to I'm just gonna start chugging and, and I won't die. So it's, it's a bit of a silly, silly way to play it more than anything. Uh, but I'm just I'm just kind of trying to get them to focus on me and you know distract them a little bit Oh, the others have spawned so we want to back off now. So we're just ping for retreat the next talent here We're gonna grab uh, is fortifying through shields nearby enemy So if I do this then I do an AOE shield so it, it's not just me that it's helping at this point. It's uh, it's everyone. I'm just kind of trying to um, Distract them more than anything. I realize they have spiders. I want to go top and I want to get this farm uh, I want to actually get this orb. So let's just jump in here. Hey <laughs> Um, oh, we need to defend. Okay. Let's go. I can, I think I can go on on this. He's got 23 gems. Oh, I need to chug. This is, this is where the problems come in is when, when I actually need to chug. Um, but we can also slow him. And, uh, oh, he's out, I think. Oh, he, he dashed back in. Silly goose. And then he slowed again. Ah, oh, he's too tanky. But then Illidan kind of went in. But then that now what's his name's ult is down, which is really good. Unfortunately, the enemy got web weavers, but there's not a lot we can do about that. What we can do is go and defend this. Um, if we can kind of clear this out as quickly as we can. Uh, let's get the orb. There we go. Then we will be... At least we, can, we, we they, they shouldn't aggress too far. Unfortunately, they got the hard camp, I believe that is, in middle lane. The mummies. So we need to be a little careful with that. So Illidan is, is going really hard for this. Unfortunately, he, he forgot that we have a charism on our team. Um, so he just kind of gave his life for that, which was really silly. Like, he, he got greedy more than anything. And you can see I'm chugging here through the fight. Oh, tits. I didn't get my ult in time. I thought we had more help, and I thought that was a friendly Naz. That was my bad. I thought the Naz was friendly. Uh, and we didn't have Nova in the fight, unfortunately. I think they'll take a four. The problem with web weavers is they do start to wear down your defenses. They might even get two. They'll, they'll get top, I think. They'll get mid. Uh, they'll get bottom. They'll probably get all three, actually. I mean, we've taken one of theirs, so we took the first one. But they are still a little bit ahead, and we need to just regroup at this point. Um, and try and try and defend. The other thing is they might go top for boss. So I'm going to ping that just to remind people that it exists. Uh, they might go top for boss, so we'll see how this, this works out. I think I've done alright, though. I'm 7 and 2. I've got 16k damage and 50,000 defense. Um, Sonya is top damage. You would expect that from Sonya. Sonya's a bit of a strange one. She shouldn't have gone in there. Like, why just throw your life away? We need to wait for everyone to regroup. Uh, I don't know why she went in. She she kind of expected... like she, It's almost as if she felt like she would do more than she did. I should mount up. I think I'm just going to get these, these two orbs more than anything. Like, if I can uh, do something here. So we'll just try and clear some of these um, with abilities, really. And then chug. There's not, I'm not, I'm not the best at clearing minions. Like, I'm not terrible, but I'm not amazing, you know. There we go. So clear this, get the orb, the orb again for the regen. I've got 26 orbs. I've been doing pretty well. 39 bonus health regen. So I'm, I'm fairly, I've got fairly good sustain at this point. Uh, and we've picked up 15 or so of these. I'm not there. I'm not there. Oh, I'm not there. I'm so aware that I'm not there. Naz is probably dead. Did he get Artanis? He did get Artanis. Oh, oh, I'm here now. Okay, 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 okay. Why is that? Oh, I've got no brew! Why have I got no brew? I'm such a fool. Oh, I'm such a fool. I had no brew and I was sitting there spamming my Q like trying to get it to work. What are you trying to do, Charism? That's how you get yourself killed. Hey, look at that. That was silly, though. I, I fucked that up. I fucked that fight up, and we got one for three because I didn't have brew and I couldn't go in and kill. We should have killed Naz, we should have killed Vala, and I... Ah! That was such a big misplay. I think it's important at least to identify when you misplay. Like, at least I knew that I misplayed there. 
they're going together mid. We need to group up. Ah, I'm such a silly goose. Like, it's all well and good I didn't die, but half my team died because I was late into that fight and then I didn't have brew. Um, that is the one thing about brew is you forget that you, you need to keep chugging. Um, it needs to be kind of habit, almost. Okay, we need to we need to go defend. Are we gonna defend? We're gonna kill Illidan. Okay, we'll kill Illidan. Kill Illidan, Illidan. Anyhow, next up we're gonna give get pressure point. So your flying kick massively slows your target. They're gonna come in here. They know we're here. We killed Illidan and then we took his the boss. This is actually really good. We should get the boss here. Oh crap, we just got destroyed. Oh, Naz isn't here. Naz isn't here. Me and Sonya went in on that. So half the team committed to the boss and half the team committed to the fight. I thought that was going to go okay. I thought we would get the boss and then get the fight, but instead what happened was we uh, we backed off. And of course, Bart is, Nova, Bart, Nova is now blaming the team, which doesn't help. Um, Naz stayed in base to defend. I think it would have been easier if, we, if we'd had him there. That would have been we would have gotten the boss, and that maybe we'd have gone another way. Um, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna place blame. I think there's no point in that, uh, really. But I, I think like you can kind of see what's going on here. They're just they're just playing the blame game. It doesn't 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 matter. It's a quick match. If it was ranked, you know. I, in fact, even if it was ranked, you shouldn't be blaming each other. Like people spend too much time like. Like, I don't know. Why is Sonya going in here? I can definitely get away into base. And this should heal up my pandas. Hey, look at that. Healthy pandas. Let's just go in base. I think that's game, to be honest. Unfortunately getting a little bit outplayed here. Their, their team is just much more coordinated than ours. Um, and there wasn't much we could do, unfortunately. I think I think we did okay. And then the team is just too busy bitching at each other. It doesn't matter. I, I agree that I think not Sonya made some mistakes. Like There was points where she should have waited for the team and she went in and just died. Um, and that's the mistake that people make. The people get so caught up in the fact that they need to defend that they kind of dive in and that's not something that you should necessarily do. Um, so I got pressure point as the last talent. That talent's really good because it slows them by 90%. Like, it's a huge slow, um, which is really useful. Unfortunately, we weren't stunning out Nazibo when he uh, when he ulted. I didn't have a stun. Sonya, her chain, I believe, is a stun. Uh, and I think that's kind of it for stuns on our team, which is, I mean, fortunate for Naz. It makes it his ult very easy. Um, and the last talent I would have picked is the one that buffs your ultimate, Elemental Condui, I think it's called, um, where you get a little, every time you use an ability, you get a little, like, panda buddy. Uh, but that's the build. I don't think the build was bad. Like, I, I think the tanking was good. I did... Took 74,000 damage and only died three times. I mean, their tank took 42,000 damage and died once. But still, I think I think I did a decent job of, of tanking there. Uh, and that's kind of what the build is about. But Chen is not an ideal pick if you need stuns for stuff like Nazibo ult. Uh, so in a ranked game, you, you'd have to pick him depending on comp, really. Um, but yeah, that's, that's kind of it, guys. What do you think of Chen? Let me know what you think of the game and uh, how you would build Chen in the comments below. If you want me to play anyone next week, again, let me know. Beyond that, we have a Facebook at facebook.com forward slash thekillerbits and a Twitter at thekillerbits. And if you want to support us uh, and allow us to, you know, get some of these newer heroes that I haven't really been able to play. Artanis, you actually can't currently buy because he's on pre-release, uh, but he'll be out on the 27th. But stuff like Morales and stuff, um, heroes aren't cheap and you need to play the game enough to get 10k gold. Uh, but yeah, you can do so at patreon.com forward slash thekillerbits. Uh, I've been Francesca and it's been lovely having you. Sorry about last week. I was really sick. You can still kind of maybe hear it a little bit in my voice. I'm a bit snuffly and stuff. Um, but I should be back next week again with another Heroes of Storm video. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.